in the rural expanse of Goethe's central constituency, where the rhythm of life harmonized with the land, a sinister plot unfolds beneath the seemingly tranquil surface. President Umningabwa's loyalists and traditional leaders, fueled by political fervor, have devised a chilling strategy against the backdrop of a looming drought. As the specter of inconsistent rainfall casts its shadow over the arid landscape, the vulnerability of the community becomes evident. Food relief efforts, a beacon of hope in times of scarcity, are underway. However, a venomous undercurrent taints these benevolent endeavors. Traditional leaders, entwined with ZANU-PF hardliners, have clandestinely decreed that sustenance would be withheld from those openly supporting President Nelson Chamisa's Citizens Coalition for Change CCC. A cruel form of discrimination unfolded, as those in need are divided not by hunger but by political allegiance. Human rights defenders, their voices echoing through the corridors of justice, have vehemently condemned this selective distribution. The very essence of humanitarian aid has been tarnished, as the basic right to sustenance became entangled in the web of political plotting. In the face of adversity, the CCC supporters find themselves grappling not only with the merciless grip of drought, but also with the insidious designs of those wielding power. The struggle for survival transcends the challenges posed by nature. It becomes a battle against a calculated and heartless attempt to silence dissent through hunger. As the community awaits relief, a somber tension hangs in the air. The plot to kill CCC supporters softly has thrust Goethe Central into a perilous dance between political allegiance and the basic human right to nourishment.